a few balls. Uh, because um, uh, they were in a very poor monument, part of the uh, special glass for that particular beer. So it's a steer ripens. The it's a very nice beer. And the watchtower coming up here on your right hand side. And the monument. Concentration camp brain dock. We have the key of the harbour, so on the right. The world of Europe dies, his grandchildren inherit a lot of money, and they start a war which ends in a division of the ancient Europe in two. There was the western part, the other side of the river here, where we didn't build... Okay, well, we got to take it out and switch it. I'll do it. Take it out and I'll switch it. about uh, problems and philosophy and painters and artists. Also in this garden, Ruben spent uh, a lot of time with his friend uh, Nicolas Fox. Now, 
when I first came into this garden here, the first thing I noticed was the uh, bottle that seemed to be ours. It's also digital. We are making that and every printer was obliged to put that list uh, in his uh, printing company. Now if you look behind you, that's an original list of all the books that Plantin was uh, forbidden to print at that time because they weren't Catholic enough. So that list was not just an old song. Now at that time in the 16th century, Antwerp was already a, a world port with uh, many nationalities living here. And each of the nationality, when they came here in the shop, business where he would enter with new clients, he would sit here at the table um, with the customer on the other side together with a good, good book uh, about the price and legacy. Different then than it is now is that at that time the author began to Now, compass two legs, one leg stands for the labore. It's uh, the, the work. You know, it's a very hard working company and a very hard working family also. And the second leg stands for constancia. It's the constancy of the business. They were successful from the beginning. Throughout generations, they were successful actually all the time. Now, this room, it was. of the Roman of um, the Roman philosopher uh, truth in it. Now um, Seneca he was a very Some of them are still even in their uh, original uh, packaging. Now, Plantin, he wanted to have an exceptional typographical quality of his printings. Now, the letter's outline was always uh, sharp, and the page's composition, it was always uh, well balanced. He traveled a lot throughout Europe in order to find top quality. Also, here in the heart.
separate as they became. Oh, there's the shears. There's the bride. <laughs> That's cool.
aluminum balls. So the symbol for the 1956 um, World Expo. Uh, yeah, it's going on the same. <laughs> There's a little joke. May I tell you? May I tell you? No. Very, very. Losing the man who is losing his hair here. Don't talk about me. And as soon, you know, the commissioner was the person, uh, the bishop or whatever, or the, the clergy. And they were the ones that said, we would like to have a cathedral here. And it means that there was a bishop see there, otherwise you can't call it a cathedral. Right. Right? Okay. And then, um, as soon as it was known that that was going to be built, um, um, crafts the same family of stonemasons in ah. different...
on the word three make a tour give you some commentary about the most important things we will see on the lake we also got some french speaking people in the boats i will do the commentary in two languages Bonjour, mesdames, messieurs, bienvenue à bord. Nous allons faire un tour d'à peu près une demi-heure et je vous donne un peu de commentaire. Je fais le commentaire en deux langues. And just past the next bridge on the right hand side, you'll see the church of Our Lady. The church has the highest tower approach, 122 meters. In the church, we have the sculpture made by Michelangelo. The point here at the right is the church of Notre Dame, with the highest tower in the city, 122 meters. Pepling, and there is also an old pharmacy at that. Mais c'est le prochain point à droite, c'est l'ancien hôpital de Saint-Jean, construit en 1188, ça veut dire que c'est le plus vieux hôpital d'Europe. Maintenant c'est un musée avec des peintures de Hans Mebling et il est aussi une ancienne pharmacie là-dedans. Ladies and gentlemen, I have to ask you to stay seated. The next bridge we go under is a very, very low one. If you stand up here, you're gonna have a headache. We had too many women in Bureau Channel, but he knew what to do with them. So they put them in a convent. And that's a true story. It's only because many men died on the Crusades. We had in that time here in Bureau Channel only one man for seven women. We call those the golden years. <laughs> Et en face de nous, c'est la maison des îles de Canals. Past the bridge, you'll see the old Neuvième Siècle renové avant 20 ans à peu près. Maintenant, nous avons un restaurant là-dedans, avec une belle terrasse, comme vous voyez. Nous aussi quelques magasins pour les touristes. Here is also a piece of the hospital. It was built in the 19th century, and it has been renovated about 20 years ago. There's now. Une mélange des herbes et on a fait des pierres avec ça. On n'avait pas doublon en ce temps. C'est maintenant un musée des antiquités avec des vieux instruments de musique, des meubles, des armes. Il faut revenir demain. In between the trees on the right here, every weekend and all the bank holidays, there is a small flea market. If you want to see that, you'll have to come back tomorrow.
S'il y a le coin à gauche, c'est une très belle vue sur le Beffroi. La tour est 83 mètres en haut et a 366 marches pour monter. La tour était construite pour représenter la force et la liberté de notre ville. We had bridges as well, but those bridges were built out of wood. Now we have 43 bridges and 5 kilometers of canals. That's the reason we call Bruges the Little Venice of the North. Prochain pont, c'est le plus vieux de la ville, construit au fin du 14e siècle. Avant ce temps, on avait aussi des ponts, mais les ponts. So it's really little Venice because Broge isn't a very small town. The ring around Broge has a length of seven kilometers and in the ring we only have 20,000 inhabitants. On appelle Bruges la petite Venise parce que Bruges est une ville petite. C'est le périphérique à longueur de 7 qui built by very rich people and given away totally free to the poor. Nowadays those houses are restored as retirement homes. It is where you see the pelican above the door. À droite ici, vous voyez le pélican au-dessus de la porte. Ce sont des maisons de Dieu, les maisons sociales de Moyen-Âge. Construites par la riche bourgeoisie, on les a données au pauvre tout gratuit. Maintenant, ce sont des maisons de retraite. Very religious people. We also have 420 pubs. <laughs> Dans la ville, nous avons 17 églises, nous sommes très croyants ici. Nous avons aussi 420 cafés. So those were not built to help Santa Claus. Était construit comme ça. Et ça ne sert à rien, les escaliers, c'est uniquement une décoration. Donc ce n'est pas pour aider Saint Nicolas ou bien Père Noël. This is not a church. At that time, they had their meetings in this place. Here, when you look at the bridge, you see the Navy, Auberge, Blessing, and the Kaiser. Ça vient d'une légende que raconte Bourges et tous les premiers habitants de Bruges. There it is on the right. This is coming from a legend which is telling that a bear was the first.
But ahead of us here, the building passed the two bridges. Is a really beautiful view coming up. Oh, not so beautiful anymore. What the towers were used for? Sur le bâtiment, vous voyez quatre tourelles rouges. Excusez-moi. J'ai quelqu'un dans le bateau qui sait. Ça serait à quoi Les quatre tourelles rouges là-haut La meilleure idée, ça ferait Execution. No. I'm going to give you a hint. The towers are... The pigeon sport is still very big in Flanders. In October 2002, there was a Flemish pigeon sold for 50,000 euros. Wow. The sport des pigeons est encore très grand ici. La gauche ici, c'est le bâché aux poissons, construit en 1821. Le bâché est encore actuel, sauf le dimanche et le lundi, c'est fermé.